Hello friends, good morning, happy Tuesday. Uh, it is just before 8.30 a.m. Sherry Beth and I are both about to leave for work, starting our day here. Uh, I am getting Sherry's lunch gathered up, and then um, we both need to head out. And lunch today is gonna be very, very simple. We're doing leftover pizza. Uh, we had this pizza last night for dinner, and so we're just gonna take the last few pieces for lunch today. And last night I forgot to put dishes away uh, before bed, so I'm just going to load the dishwasher. The dishwasher is dirty, so I'm just gonna load this up and then get it running so that when we get home, all of our dishes are nice and clean. There. We go. I normally like to do that in the evening so that when I come downstairs in the morning, the kitchen is clean, just like a nice start to the day. Um, last night we recorded a podcast for this coming Saturday and then a friend texted, uh, she has family visiting that she wanted us to meet. So we actually went and met them. So my normal nightly routine of picking up did not happen, but at least I got it done in the morning. Morning, Sherry Beth. Good morning. How are you? Okay, how are you? Good, you picking out your tea for the day? Yeah. It's a very big decision. Yeah. I asked Sherry if she wanted to stop by the coffee shop on her way to work or if she was going to bring tea and she said she's going to bring her own tea. I'm going to bring tea. Let's see what she's going to choose today. Mm. Oh man, this is is this one of your most stressful decisions of the day? <laughs> kind of is. All right, let's see what you chose. Blackberry sage. Blackberry sage. Have you had this one before? Yes, and it's so good. Mm. All right, jacket is on, kitchen light is off. Let's go to work. I just left the house, and as you can see, it is a foggy morning here in Anchorage. Uh, not that cold, actually. It's 28 degrees, which isn't too bad, especially considering the weather we're supposed to have later this week, which, well, I'll tell you about in a minute. All right, well, it's a few hours later, um, and I think where I left off on the vlog is I was going to tell you about the weather. That, like, it's not too bad today, but it's going to get bad because, you guys, this is crazy. Um, later this week, in fact, I'm pulling it up right now, um, it is supposed to be, oh gosh, just not pleasant at all. Uh, so on Thanksgiving, we are looking at negative one as a low. I don't think we've been below zero yet. Uh, Thanksgiving, negative one. Uh, Friday, low of zero. Saturday, low of zero. Then next week back up into like maybe the 30s, but the next few days Are gonna get super chilly. So it's 27 now. I will take it. Uh, my first meeting went great. Like I'm um, My first meeting was about uh, something really exciting. We're gonna tell you guys about soon and I'm feeling Very hopeful and emotional and encouraged and it just went really really good now it is, what time is it? 11.30 and I am going to, I think, go find a coffee shop and sit and work for a little bit. So, so far today is like, if I only have two thumbs, so I can only give it a two thumbs up day. If I had more thumbs, I would put those up as well. Next stop is gonna be Black Cup Coffee Shop, which I think will be my office for a little bit. Also, look at this store. Oh my gosh. Looks like a winter wonderland. All right, I'm all set up. I got an eight ounce brevet with, I'm trying to think of what their syrup was. I don't even remember, but got that and a croissant. All right, I am done with work at the coffee shop and now I'm going to City Diner. Uh, Sherry is actually able to leave work a little bit early today or leave the office a little bit early. And we decided to meet each other for lunch, which is something we don't always get to do during the week. And uh, this was on our way home, and so we decided to stop here. Sherry's on her way, I'm gonna go get a table. All sorts of good things here on the menu, breakfast stuff, sandwiches, of course, omelets, burgers. Hmm. This uh, loaded mac and cheese with mushroom, ham, bacon, spinach, tomato with garlic toast uh, is my mom's favorite thing here. She actually asked me recently if they still have it on the menu, and I told her I didn't know. So, uh, mom, they still got it. Well, 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 look who we have here. Hi. Hi. When we uh, both work from the office, we don't always get to see each other in the middle of the day. It's kind of nice. Oh my gosh, I want chicken fried steak. It came with eggs and rye toast and hash browns. Sherry Beth got a grilled chicken sandwich with, what is that, broccoli cheddar soup? Is it good? 
looks really good. Today's a good soup day. Yeah. Look at that though. It's huge. Well, we destroyed it. It was so good. Sherry's sure got some chicken sandwich and soup coming home with us. Yep. Back out into the fog. <laughs> All right, last stop before heading home is gonna be the post office to check the P.O. box. And just like that, it was last week we announced our Lug Life Christmas card exchange and you all wasted no time. So I checked the P.O. box yesterday and there were five cards in there. There are five more today. So you guys really are wasting no time. Uh, today's cards are from Washington, Washington, Anchorage, Ohio, and Michigan. Thank you, friends. We will get your cards uh, out today. I just got home and I realized that the Christmas cards from yesterday, I forgot to take the post office and mail. So I will address all of these and mail them with those. All right, so this is actually the film we're going to see tonight, um, Allergic to Love. Our friend Steven is the one who, uh, who made this. You can see the Anchorage premiere that's we're doing tonight. Uh, if you are on Instagram, you want to check it out. It's just Allergic to Love film. Um, and you can kind of watch some of the trailers, some of the behind the scene things. So go check it out on Instagram. We are going to bring you along tonight. There's our friend. Look at that. Um, we are going to bring you along tonight to the premiere and uh, show you a little bit of it. You guys, look at this. This is, uh, these are cards that you all have sent us so far. And it's not even Thanksgiving yet. All right, leaving the house. It's 5.40 p.m. Feels like it's 9.40 p.m. <laughs> it looks like it's 9.40 p.m. <laughs> I know. Walked outside and I was like, are we late to the premiere? It's like, oh no, we're still an hour early. Oh, it's only 5.30. Okay. Oh, you guys. I feel like every vlog this winter has just been us talking about how dark it is. I do feel like it got dark quicker this year. I, it probably didn't. It In probably fact, didn't. I'm sure it I didn't. It just, it just feels, feels that like way. Totally. So the premiere is downtown at the Anchorage Museum. That is where we're heading next. Yeah. We have made it downtown. Uh, tell me this isn't like the most wintry scene ever. Just all the frost on the trees, the fog, the snow, the Christmas lights. And the premiere is here at the Anchorage Museum. Um, what's kind of fun about this is that we are going in an entrance, just kind of right up here below this big light. When I was growing up, this was actually the main entrance of the museum. Now we have a big entrance, like the big fancy entrance around the corner since they did the big expansion. But the whole time I would grow up and come to the museum, these were the doors we went in. We have made it into the museum. So this is like the main lobby. Uh, a lot of high schools have their proms in here. There's a lot of weddings in here. It's a pretty space. Look how cool this is. Oh my gosh, we got in early so we could get a seat. And look at this. They got double shovel cider here. Sure you got wine? Mm -hmm. This is the best. Honestly, like probably half of you are people that were involved in the crew, involved in the cast, um, and then also crowdfunding as well. So yeah, thank you for everybody for being here. All right, we are leaving the museum. The movie is over. We will give you a full review when we get in the Jeep, yeah. but oh my gosh. Now we gotta try to get across the street that does not have a crosswalk <laughs> without dying on ice. We're <laughs> laughing at the height difference. Like when Sherry, it's like, how's that? Look at Sherry's little eyes in the corner of the screen. We'll, we'll get Sherry in the shot. <laughs> All right, we are home from the movie premiere. <laughs> mm -hmm. It was amazing. It was so good. Everything Steven does is I mean, he's just one of the most creative people I've ever met. So we knew it was going to be good. It was even better than expected. We have known him for... Years. Years and years. I worked with him for a hot minute. That is true. A <laughs> uh, long time. Yeah. And he really is. He's one of those people that I feel like whatever he touches, you know it's going to be good. In fact, so um, he crowdfunded a lot of this movie. And we mm -hmm. donated to it. Um and the thing is, it didn't even matter what the movie was, what the plot was. Steven is one of those people that, <laughs> if he's behind something, 
I feel comfortable giving money to it yeah. because you know it's going to be amazing. Yeah, and I mean, he kind of gave us like the the general idea of what it was going to be, and we were just like, yes, here's here's some money. <laughs> yes, <laughs> obviously, yes. <laughs> uh, it was an yeah. it's eleven minutes long, so it is a mm -hmm. short. Uh, it was funny. The documentary about like the behind the scenes was fifteen minutes. It was actually <laughs> longer than the movie. Yeah. Uh, it's in a few film festivals. It's at the Anchorage International Film Festival next week. Yeah. Um, I think you said they've been accepted to like the New York Film Festival. The New York International Film Festival. And they've uh, applied to like 50 others. Mm -hmm. uh, I told Sherry, yes, it is a short, but quality wise, it's the kind of thing I would expect to see on Netflix or on. Yeah. Uh, it, it was just so unbelievable. It was so good. We laughed out loud. Yeah. It was touching. <laughs> uh, my goodness. It was just yeah. really great. So I'm going to link down below to, uh, I'll actually link to their Instagram account. Mm -hmm. So if you're on social media and you want to follow Allergic to Love, uh, the premise, it's about a guy who's allergic to falling in love. <laughs> Anytime he starts to fall in love, he like literally breaks out. It's and, like, so hives good. And like the swollen eye and the whole thing. It's just, it's so freaking good. So <laughs> it's really good. Glad that we got to, uh, glad that we got to go and watch the premiere of our friend's new movie. Support our friend. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And it is time to put our thankful thing on the board. And I am going to continue that theme we just talked about. Um, even though I don't really write really, really well. Cree. Creative, Sherry, can you not mock me? <laughs> Creative friends, that is what I am thankful for today. All right, Sherry, it's your turn. Also, why am I so bad at writing? That is what I'm not thankful for. I am not thankful for having to write on a dang chalkboard. Thank you. I appreciate you making it somewhat better. You tried to salvage something that is unsalvageable. <laughs> All right. Oh, a good job. A good job. Like work, do you mean? Yes. I thought you were saying like, oh, Adam did a good job writing on the chalkboard. <laughs> no, I'm thankful for my good job. I'm very thankful for your good job too. Yeah, it's a good job. And I was just reminded today, uh, going into the office that I like my coworkers and I like my job and not everybody can say that, so. I was just gonna say, that is something that not everybody can be thankful for. Thankful for it. We actually do have one more person we are thankful for. Um, it, this was unexpected. We were leaving <laughs> our house earlier and there was an Amazon box outside our front door, which was confusing to us because we received almost all of the Amazon packages, but we weren't supposed to get any orders today. Nope. And so I uh, looked at the box and instantly, instantly <laughs> knew who it was from because mm -hmm. who was it addressed to? Adam Michelle. Adam Michelle. <laughs> and so I knew. Some of y'all know. Jessica Violet. <laughs> Freaking Jessica Violet. So we opened it up and I was like, oh, what could this be? First of all, it's peeps. I knew those weren't for me because I think these should go in the garbage. Give them right to Sherry. <laughs> and then it was also three bags of my favorite Cadbury mini snowballs. Here's what's funny. Earlier today, like a half an hour. Oh, if that. If that. Before we left the house, I finished my bag of these and I was out. And then, I'm but telling the you. The Lord provided. The Lord provided <laughs> through Jessica Violet um, with my favorite Christmas candy. So she, uh, she has basically, she has spoiled us. We're always thankful for her. But. We are always, if there was a <laughs> lifetime thankfulness board in the leg household, Jessica Violet would always be on it. Yeah. Not for the peeps, but for these. Well, we're about to wrap up the vlog, but first, you guys, I have something very important. This is a life pro tip. Um, and this video is going up Wednesday. We're not going to have another video go up uh, before you need to know this. Sherry has no idea what I'm going to say. I have no idea. I'm just, I'm waiting. One of my things that I do every single year if you are like me and you get annoyed by the amount of spam emails you get, all of the different things you sign up for throughout the year, um, this week, the next few days with Black Friday, you are going to be receiving emails from every mailing list <laughs> you have signed up for. If you take the next few days and every time you get an email from somebody you don't want to, unsubscribe from it. Use the unsubscribe feature. <laughs> if you do that just over the next like 48 hours, um, you will basically like remove a bunch of inbox decluttering for the whole rest of the year. Oh. It's one of my life pro tips. That's cute. Is that around Black Friday, 
like unsubscribe, 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 because they're all gonna email you. That's true. They've already started. Yeah. So that's what I'm gonna be doing in the next 48 hours, just <laughs> unsubscribe, unsubscribe. unsubscribe. <laughs> yeah, probably get arthritic thumbs <laughs> from being unsubscribe. How was your day? It was a good day. Yeah? Yeah. Work was good, we got to have lunch together. We got to have lunch together, that was nice. It was very nice. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, that was unexpected. Uh, the movie, like we said, amazing. So good. Just a really fun day. We both took a little nap this afternoon. We did, it was <laughs> it was just overall a really good day. Mm -hmm. um, I feel like we got to do a bunch of different things and I'm feeling, uh, I think, fulfilled yeah. as we end the day. Friends, we're not gonna have another video before Thanksgiving. And so we just wanna say how thankful we are for all of you. If you're here in America, obviously be celebrating Thanksgiving, uh, but no matter where you live in the world, um, the reality of focusing on thankfulness is something we all can do better at yeah. and do more of. Uh, and you guys in our community are one of the things that we are so very thankful for. We love you friends and we'll see you on the next Lug Life video.